My name's Cam Restrum and I'm the Managing Director at the Brightex Group. My father bought the business back in 1980, but Brightex was established back in 1938. So I've been in the business 20 years and I've been running it for 12. It's been a really enjoyable 12 years, but it's been a phenomenal 20 year period in watching Brightex grow to where we've got it now. My name is Edmund Dahl and I work for Brightex. I'm mainly I'm a trades, sheet metal tradesman. I'm mainly manufacturing stainless steel benches and urinals. My name's John Dolan. I'm the, uh, the manager of the, uh, the bench deck range. So I've been in here nearly uh, 10 years now. Well, the beauty, I suppose, of Brightex is that I don't have just the one role. I mean, we're a team here. I've been working for Brightex since the year 2000. The company has come a long way with machinery and the way we do things. We've been developing products right through the 16 years that I've been here. And at the end of the day, we try and give our customer the best product that we can. We're very conscious of making sure we've got products that people need. And we keep adapting those products to make sure they change and move on with the times. We want to make sure we're always investing in the best equipment, the best machinery. That helps motivate the guys on the factory floor when they can see that the management team and the family are investing in new products. We bought a new press just at the end of last year and that was a significant investment in making sure that we can continue to do what our customers need. We've done products all over Australia and we've ventured out to the USA and all over the world. Because we're manufacturing most of our products here in our Melbourne manufacturing facility, we can adapt those products to suit. We work very hard to make sure that we really stay at the forefront of where the industry goes. The interesting job that I can remember over the years was a, a urinal that we made which uh, had a Perspex cover in the middle of it and it was for a TV screen to go behind it. I believe it was for Brighton Bars, something to do with Sam Newman putting Eddie Maguire's face on it. So that was an interesting one. Predominantly I've done a lot of projects with hospitals, so there's been the Royal Women's or the Royal Children's, Olivia Newton-John Cancer Care. My role in that was the, the project manager, so once we were awarded the project, it was my job to design and coordinate how this area of that project was going to run smoothly. We're very focused on manufacturing in Australia. I take what I do and what we do at Brightex very seriously in that we employ 80 odd people, that's 80 odd families, and we want to make sure that there is longevity for all of those people. The team here is brilliant. We get told you find your area and you make it your own. You make the decisions. You feel it's right, they trust you. Coming here, doing my job, doing your work. The guys here are great fun, and I really mean that. That's what makes me go every day. The culture here is very good. We all have a, have a bit of a joke, but we all, it, all know at the end of the day we've got a job to do. We all get along really well as a team and as a group. It's important that you get along great with everyone and you want to wake up every morning and come to work.